and our sons must become men, such men as we hope our daughters, born and unborn, will be pleased to live among. Our sons will be pleased to live among. Our sons will not grow into women. Their way is more difficult than that of our daughters, for they must move away from us without us. Hopefully our sons have what they have learned from us and a howness to forge it into their own image. Audre Lorde, Man Child, a Black Lesbian Feminist Response. The nausea. All black pregnant women have the nausea when they find out that soon the embryo will become a child. The nausea is not just a morning sickness, but butterflies that occur in the pregnant stomach and thereafter. Yes, even after the man child is born, a queasy uneasiness too far from anything tangible. It's just something you know. A mix of fear, apprehension, anxiety, and a strong feeling of hope. Hope that you don't get the call that he is strung up somewhere, not by his umbilical cord that could be untangled by the doctors, his lungs chorus to breathe, but by rope, by electrical wire, by chain, by the V8 engine power of a Ford dragging him to pieces. Forces that want to choke the life out of him, some slow, some quick. The black mother knows these forces are out there waiting and biding their time waiting to reach their arms around the necks of the children yet to be born of the black womb, waiting their turn to eat the backs, the eyes, the necks, the hearts, and the hands, to throw the dismembered bodies, parts back to the mother to reclaim. How will she be able to see her baby after what they have done or would do to him? <laughs> 